Four of the best teams competed in a different style of Han event, a one versus one show match for a mix of fun, but also a $5,000 winner takes all prize pool. Here is a recap of the five biggest plays made throughout the event. With Reason Gaming on the verge of elimination, the support player Saint Rocks would have to match up his Monkey King against Lapt. A win would set up a ninth and final game, but a loss would give Sync Esports the victory. Saint Rocks not only would make a good play, but buys a surprisingly very effective item to secure victory. More pressure, back and forth, back and forth. Look at the freaking uh, chainmail actually on Saint Rocks. He's going in, misses the one jump slam. Don't but, dive this. Ooh, don't, don't chase, dive, don't chase. Yeah. That could have been risky. But the yeah. chainmail mitigating a lot. Here we go. Zap going back in. He's going to get him. He's going to get him. St. Rox, he he one just slam. No. Yes. He gets it. St. <laughs> Rox gets it. Let's go, Mickey. <laughs> we are going. What? I don't even know what happened there. They, they were both just in like crazy panic mode, it seemed like. It's like somebody just died, damn it. Keizu and Probusk would match up with Pebbles as the hero. Despite a great effort from Keizu to use position in his favor with a chuck and tower range, Probusk and his bracer advantage would prove to be the very slight difference maker for the win. Now he's going for it. Yep, is this oh. gonna do it? Stalagmites back and forth. Probusk chucks him backwards, actually. He wants to kill himself. He gets chucked against. in the tower range. Oh, oh, auto attacks! Oh, oh. Probusk gets it! <laughs> Probusk gets it! Oh, that was so damn close. Oh, man. <laughs> Rage <Damn>. quit. <laughs> How appropriate. Arguably, well not really, the two best 1v1 players in the event, Mickey and Limp, go up against one another on Torturer. Limp was coming in with seven wins in a row, including a clean 5-0 sweep against all of Team Excellent just before. But Mickey did not let this phase him, and despite being down an early farm, and a little bit of Han God's luck, he would pick up the kill and take the win. Oh, he's going oh, for it. Mickey. He's going to power supply. Chain reactions hits. A pill attacks. He needs to hit. He can get this. He one can get more. It. One he more. Mickey has it. Mickey Yay. gets it. He takes out Limp. And they finally knock off the 1v1 god, apparently. They call him Mini Meander. Moon Meander would come back as part of the Legends team and match up against Mickey. Once again on Torturer, Moon Meander did the math and chose to go Impalement instead of Agonizing Bonds, not a popular choice amongst others. Going in for the kill, Moon nearly pulls it off, but he gets in tower range and there is Mickey to strike back and take it. Again, going aggressive. Okay, oh, here, we go. okay here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, he gets the chain reactions. The auto attacks, the Impalement, the creeps take a lot of it. Oh, he can't dodge the tower damage! No, he's not gonna... Oh! Oh, oh my god! Mickey gets it! Oh no! Oh, too close to the tower! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh man. Wow. Look at Mickey in response. To kick off the event, Sync would send out Flensmeister and Reason Gaming would send out Adro to play Soul Stealer. Now on paper, a lot of people may have predicted Flensmeister, and even during the game, he was very far ahead. Adro would need not only a very sneaky play, but a little bit of luck as well. We'll just watch. He's getting low. Here he goes. He's going for the fog around the oh, side. What is this? might be it. No! No! Oh! Oh! Adro just did it! <laughs> Are you kidding me? I told you, man. He needed to go around the side. <laughs> Atta boy, Adro. I am so confused right Okay, so Flensmeister, he was dropping his items because he was getting regen. So he was trying to do the, the nifty, you know, get less stats, get more efficient regen as a result. That was the worst timing ever. <laughs> I mean, oh. Nitro went in for the kill. I, I cannot believe it.